Uh, in this video, we will solve a problem that was asked by a brother on Telegram channel of EconMaths. The question is, if Q is equal to 100 upon P, Q is the quantity, P is the price, when price is less or equal to $5, and marginal cost is, let us say, $2, the profit maximizing price is, the options are 10, less than 5, 20, or $5, okay? So, we are being given the demand function is Q is equal to 100 upon P, okay? Now, uh, if I multiply this P with this Q, so our P into Q will be equal to 100. And we know this P into Q is simply our total revenue. That means our total revenue is equal to 100. We are being also told that marginal cost is equal to 2. Okay. Now we know profit maximizing condition is that marginal revenue should be equal to marginal cost now marginal revenue is the derivative of total revenue function okay so our marginal revenue will be d t r upon d q taking the derivative of this function with respect to output since we have a constant its derivative is equal to zero okay so applying this condition marginal revenue is equal to marginal cost our marginal revenue is equal to zero here which implies if I use this, which implies here our 0 should be equal to marginal cost is equal to 2, which is not possible. Okay, we cannot use this method uh, in solving this question. Okay, so definitely we need another logic here because our marginal revenue came out to be 0 and our marginal cost is equal to 2. So we cannot apply this very logic of profit maximization here. Okay, now you can simply see here we have price into output is equal to 100 as we have uh, derived here that means our total revenue is constant when we have the total revenue constant and we are also being told that price is less or equal to 5 okay this condition is being to given us when we have a constant uh, total revenue then the firm will apply or charge highest possible price okay highest possible price okay and the condition is price is less or equal to for you if firm is charging high, uh, you know highest possible price so highest possible price can be only for you here that means for you into output should be equal to 100 and here you can see uh, for you times uh, so in place of q we will have 20 that means for you into 20 is equal to 100 when we have constant uh, total uh, you know revenue then the firm will charge highest possible price and will produce lowest possible revenue and here you can see for you into 20 is equal to 100 the correct option should be this very thing that means option d should be correct now let us try to prove this result whether it uh, whether uh, this price that is p is equal to uh, you know for you is really the profit maximizing price or not let me show it here okay to make the things more simpler for, uh, simpler for you to understand okay simple thing we know that profit is equal to total revenue minus total cost okay and total revenue is price into output and what is total cost the integral of marginal cost gives us so total cost is simply the integral of marginal cost so our uh, the integral of 2 with respect to q will be that means our total cost will be equal to 2 q here okay simple thing I have to find out the total cost from marginal cost function. So our total cost will be 2Q. So we have here 2Q. Now let us see when when price was for you, quantity was 20. What will be our profit? When price is for you, output is 20 minus 2 into output is 20. Let me write it here again 20. So we have 5 20s are 100 minus 2 20s are 40, which gives us profit as 100 minus 40 is 60. Let's take other value here, okay? 
a price which is less than 5 let us take price is equal to 4 if i take price is equal to 4 then we know our price into quantity should be equal to 100 if i take price is equal to 4 then what will be our output so that our revenue remains constant so 4 times 25 that means our q will be 25 using this condition again our profit will be equal to total revenue that means p into q p into q is uh, 4 into 25 minus twice the output which is uh, 25 which gives us here uh, this is 25 uh, 25 into 4 is 100 minus 2 into 25 is uh, 50 here you can see profit is 100 minus 50 which comes out to be 50 okay any other price less than 5 will give us less profit you can see when price was 5 our profit was maximum which is 60 when price was less than 5 you can see our profit has declined from 60 to 50 okay so the logic here is simple when we have constant revenue okay then the firm will charge highest possible price and will produce lowest possible output we cannot use mr is equal to mc condition here okay it will fail here so you have to think out of box here okay i hope i make myself clear thank you